Assalamu alaikum guys, good evening, Khoinad. Uh, guys, I uh, hope you're well, had a great uh, long weekend, um, been doing a bit of work, but I just wanted to tell you a little bit about African Cornfields, the project that I'm running in Zimbabwe. It's come a long way in seven years. We've had a great time developing the asset in Zimbabwe. It's not uncommon for people to be working in Zimbabwe and making money, especially in the uh, industry of resources. Um, a lot of people are actually doing it, and uh, more and more people are investing into Zimbabwe. But I don't want to bore you with the details other than to tell you that we've been sort of wanting to educate a lot of people around Zimbabwe and the possibilities of great success of businesses down there. Resources are abundant, as I mentioned in one of my previous uh, discussions. And the human capital is amazing, that's intelligent, as I always keep on mentioning. Get bored of me about that. The bottom line is that I think that um, African Cornfields has reached the point where we're about to launch our lumothermic plant. It'll be June, July this year. Uh, it's an amazing project. It's one of the first in the world. I won't say one of the first, one of the very few in the world. Uh, we compete with, we will compete with a company in Germany and in, in Russia. It's a, a lumothermic process that doesn't require power to do reduction of uh, ore um, or oxides. It, um, develops an ultra-low-carbon, low-carbon ferrochrome, a high-grade ferrochrome, because Zimbabwe's chrome is amazing. Um, going forward, we're going to become an exporter of this particular product. We're off the grid, believe it or not. People use thousands of kilowatts per hour per ton for reduction in a process that would take about six or seven hours. Ours takes literally two minutes. I know you're saying that's crazy. I also thought to, so six years ago when we were developing it, but it does take two minutes. And given the opportunity in the foregoing month or two, I'm going to make a movie and show you how that works in our factory. The factory is almost complete. Um, we have a new South African minority partner that will join us, um, who invested in a project with us that didn't do too well. So we put them into African Cromfields and into the Lumothermic uh, plant. The Lumothermic plant is, uh, I don't know of any other one this size. Uh, however, it's amazing. It's in the middle of Zimbabwe in a very rural area. Um, it's now complete. It's quite a big facility and I'm going to give you guys a movie late in the month or perhaps next month before we open around how this process works and what we're doing. Uh, but this is just an update on African Cornfields because you've seen that name now in the media. Just to explain to you what it does, it does a lumothermic chrome, which is uh, processed uh, chromite uh, into ultra low carbon ferrochrome and low carbon ferrochrome. Um, the other things that obviously we do is uh, chrome mining and beneficiation and washing of the chrome for export. We're supporting local industry at the moment. It's going quite well. Uh, we do believe that we need to support the local industry in Zimbabwe and uh, smelters that are actually doing reduction. That's our first priority because it creates jobs. In African cornfields, we're going to top around 2,000 people in the next little while uh, as employees. And the outreach of affected people positively is around 10,000 people at the mine, including family members, uh, immediate and so on. So I just thought that was a great update and I wanted to let you guys know about it. You can look on the website if you want, and I look forward to sending you the movie that talks about two minutes reduction of uh, ferrochrome. Thank you very much, guys, and have a good evening.